Oh, drop and roll, man. He's on fire, man. Put him out. Get the distinguisher, boy. What's up, guys? I'm Al Brunel, and I must ask you a question. What's the best skate park you guys have ever been to and why? Leave it down in the comments. Anyways, I'm out here today at MLK Skate Park in Oceanside, and this park is unreal. It's little, but it has like so many obstacles, flowy bowl, hips, all the goods. But enough talking, let's get into some skating. Oh, that'd be sick. Look, it's kind of like a weird angle. You came at it like almost like you're gonna go exactly. like front side. So I had to readjust like last minute. And when you do that, it's scary. It's definitely, it's like a 50 50 chance landing. In the you got one of those full caps? Yeah, I do. Ooh, let's see. Get one today. Wow. Yeah, I think it's gonna work well. I think the only thing with doing this one is I'm gonna do the rock fakie on this wall because I'm doing the rock fakie over there. It's angled this way. The wall's right here. It's just kicking me at the wrong angle. Oh yeah. So if I do it more here, I'll be more straight. Get the angle, do the cab uh, Is it gonna be hard to get speed like from the smaller quarter pipe to the big one though? It is gonna be a little bit harder, but um, in time, once you get your rock fakies down, you can just deck it all the way up. And like pump, pump out, out of it. it. Yeah, all right. Something we'll teach you guys in time. All right, let's see it. Whoa! That was looking so good. I can't believe I almost landed that second try. This Dude, is you popped it up there. You're, you're on a good session. Today's Last like one of those, it's a good skate day for you. It is a great skate day. Last, last time I did this trick was at uh, Fraser Farms, my first edit ever on YouTube. Really? Uh, secret best private mini ramp in, in California. You'll see the link right here. <laughs> Pretty big. Well, the fire is hot. The fire is hot. You don't I need to. With that. <laughs> dude, that was sick. Third try. Hi. Thank you. Yeah, Piping nice, me up dude. to get that. So you can see in the bowl here, infinite amount of lines. Corner there, hip there, two corners here. Really cool thing I like about this bowl is this right here. If you can see it, it's quarter pipe to bang. So if you're tired of skating the bowl, you could do a fly out over into this thing like a tabletop and go straight into the street course. Firing line. So, like unlimited flow. Started over here, went over there, homie got in the way. 
But we kept it going, you know? Kept the flow going. It doesn't stop at this park. Now let me catch my breath. All right, so just cruising around the park. You can see like they used every little space they could, you know, they got quarter pipes on the back side of the bowl here. I kind of like how they don't have a quarter pipe on this side, just cause it's like, it's a bit easier to, uh, to manage, like to get lines, you have to swerve in, swerve out just to hit this quarter pipe. So that's really cool. We have this Jersey barrier, bank to Jersey bear. I love anything like this, steep transition. It's different. Not a lot of parks have these. More parks these days are building obstacles like this. Um, but I always think it's cool to have an obstacle like this because it kind of motivates you to get out into the streets, go bell spots, DIY jersey barriers, like the one me and Dowdy did, link right here. But uh, yeah, super fun spot. Sorry my eyes are going crazy. It's really bright out here today. so cool it's unreal right here it drops off on this side quarter pipe on both sides a little pole jam going up like wally super fun obstacle i'm gonna try to get a wally back lip on there that's what i really want to get on there This backside lip slide is killing me right now. This thing is so hard. Got the front side lip slide first try. The backside lip slide on it, I keep sticking. So I think I gotta go faster and launch it. This obstacle's so cool though, you know? It's a spine, wallable, ledge on the other side. A lot of possibilities. You don't see stuff like this at other parks. So it's really cool to hit this here. Like that, yeah, dang. Like that. A little Some... sketchy on the land, but you know it's a skate park. Beggars can't be choosers. Yeah. I worked my butt off for that earlier, so yeah, you earned that one. Earned it. So this rail right here is in a very interesting spot, just because there's two. You know, there's a pyramid bank right here. On the other side is a bowl, so it's like it's kind of like in a weird spot that you know you won't really see many people hitting it. I guess you could go from bank to bank. But as far as like having the bowl on the other side, it's kind of scary. So if you were to try a trick on the rail, you know, you're taking that risk of falling in the bowl, which would kind of suck, let's be honest. But uh, I mean, it is cool in the sense that you can get like very creative. Like I bet you could like air out from the pool, like no stall there, pull over, nose blunt into the bank. Like you get super creative. So it's cool to have something like that here, you know, versus just having nothing there. So next thing we're gonna talk about is this uh, quarter pipe to bank. I know it looks weird, but it's so cool because this is really gonna help you guys like learn how to wall ride. It's slightly banked, so it's not a full wall, but by having an obstacle like this, it can like push you to go to other parks or other spots that are just full banked straight wall to learn wall ride. So I kind of like this, it's different and different's good. Next thing we're gonna check out is this vert wall. I'm sure you guys have seen this vert wall in a lot of video parts throughout the years. I certainly have, um, but this is a sick vert wall. It's probably like nine, eight feet, eight or nine feet, I'd say. Probably about four feet of tranny, four feet of vert. So it's about even, but it's a good vert wall. It rides really good. Let's get some tricks on here. Maybe a hilly monster, back lip up the side, back D, who knows? There's a lot of possibilities here, but it's cool because this vert wall also kind of like leads into the beginning of the bowl. And that bowl is unreal as we were talking about earlier. So, you know, having a park with all these different obstacles, it really creates fun and you can come here, try different things, not get tired out. Um, you know, it's, it's not fun to go to a park that you're bored of or you don't know what to try because there's not too many obstacles. So having like, you know, a uh, diversity of different stuff to skate 
really, you know, allows for more fun and more progression in your skating. Hit this pool coping right here. Uh, it's the same pool coping that's in the bowl. Super hard, super rough, um, but it grinds so good. Like at first look, you, you don't think it's gonna grind, but once you actually like get on top of a grind, the thing glides, it literally goes for miles. A lot of parks these days are just like very standard, very stairs, rails, not too much. This park's different and it has a lot to offer. I didn't even see the quarter pipe on the back side of this quarter pipe, just to talk about that. Like they really used what room they had to make this as sick as possible. And this park, you know, in my book, this is probably like an eight out of 10 park. I mean, I'm a hard judge, but I think it could like, if it had like a cradle, a few other things, it could be a 10 out of 10, but you know, we can't, we can't give it a perfect score. been a total of like three tries i think he's tried this more than any other trick in this edit just to know that all this stuff is going down pretty damn quick it's insane all right try four try four there's more coming I guess like that's good to show you. Hopefully I'll put this in the edit just to show you that it's not always super gnarly, but here comes the gnarly one. Oh, all right. He's working his way up to it. This is what I was doing earlier. I was trying to learn inverts and how to like make my way up. Baby steps, yeah. Kind of like, you know, get yourself confident. So you land a few in a row, get your super meter up. Definition of butt hurt. Oh. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Oh, by the way, this is after you just slammed. I just ate shit. I felt really hard on my butt. I was sitting in the back seat, fully laid out. Um, but you can tell that this park is so much fun. There's so many obstacles. And believe it or not, I'm living with Dowdy now. So this is going to be one of my home parks, and you're going to be seeing a lot more lines here. I'm excited to see uh, what my skating produces from this being my local. So yeah. thanks for watching, guys. As <laughs> always, much love. Hit that subscribe button. If you guys like the video, don't forget to hit that like button. And I'll see you guys on the next one.